Hey everybody, Hi. Facebook Live, KTSU 90.9, Facebook Live host and Trishelle, the electric personality. Standing next to me is Alyssa R. Jones, author, activist, speaker, yes. the owner of Survivors <laughs> with a Voice. How are you, beautiful? I'm doing good. How are you? Doing well. So, at, as, inspire, empower. These mm -hmm. are words that people use to describe you. Yeah. How does that make you feel? That makes me feel good because there was a point where I needed inspirement, empowerment. So just to be able to be on the flip side of that and get through all the stuff that I've been through, mm -hmm. it's an amazing journey. Houston Zone, Grammy nominated the Walls Grammy. Hey, 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 hey. Yes. <laughs> Not only are they here celebrating Chad Bradley, but they are siblings worshiping together. Yes. What does it mean to support one another in this industry? Um, it's very, very important, especially because this is what we do, especially in gospel music. It means, this, this is what Christianity is all about, is yeah. loving one another, unity, and being supportive of one another. So it's only fitting that we do it in the gospel industry as well. So That's very, right. You know who this is. Here's this old Brian Courtney Wilson. How are you, sir? I'm doing good. How good. are you? I'm doing so well. So September is Gospel Music Month, and you're here celebrating one of our gospel greats, Mr. Chad Brawley. How does that feel? It feels great, Chad. Chad, like you said, he's a gospel great. Um, he's demonstrated that over and over again here in the Houston area uh, through his playing, through his leadership at various churches and music ministry, mm -hmm. and tonight with his first live recording. Mm -hmm. I cannot wait to uh, hear what he's going to bring forth tonight, and I'm so glad to be here and honor his faithfulness. Standing here with the pastor of this great church, the Luke Umbel, Mr. Pastor Dr. <laughs> Timothy W. So Sloan. good to see you here. Yeah. Well, Chad Brawley, your minister of music, celebrating this great man yeah. today. How does that make you feel that he's accomplished something so wonderful? It's really hard, literally, to put into words um, just how, like, super proud I am tonight of Chad. Chad is just a, a phenomenal gift. He, he, he's a young man who, who has deep roots in the church. He has been literally a, a legend in the making. I, I, I want to use those words, I mean, because he literally is. It, the way he's been such a gift to the Houston community, the greater Houston community, and even to the national, global context. Chad has been across the globe. Tonight, to know that Chad is a part of the Luke Church, that Chad is a part uh, of this ministry, and to see this come to fruition after hearing him talk about this vision, it, it means a great deal, I think not just to me, but this entire congregation. Mm -hmm. We are just so grateful and proud uh, of Chad and, and what God's doing in his life. here with my cousin in my mind, Miss Jotina. Jotina, you do it all. Such a superwoman, Arthur, philanthropist, teacher, single mother to your best girl. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. Girl. How do you continue to overcome and move forward? Oh, my God. See, the, the big thing is centering yourself, right? Just find that quiet space and place and really centering yourself because what will happen is life. It will happen every single day. So I encourage you to find your balance, find your center, and be sure to affirm yourself. I live by the words. Change your language and you'll change your life. That's it. <laughs> hey, Facebook Live, we are here with the man of the hour, the reason why we are all here. I am the electric personality, your KTSU 90.9 Facebook Live host, Andrew Shell, and Chad Brawley. Chad Brawley is yep, here. Yep, yep, yep. Chad Brawley, we're here at your album release, We Worship Concert. Mm -hmm. What is the inspiration behind We Worship? Uh, just, just wanting everybody to participate um, in praise and worship and in the worship experience every Sunday morning and at home having a relationship with the Lord and just pursuing God, mm -hmm. you know, that kind of thing. Now you describe this album as a, a vertical worship. Mm -hmm. What does that mean to have a vertical worship? So uh, vertical meaning we're addressing God. So mm -hmm. God, you this, God, you, we love you, addressing God and just talking to him kind of thing. Mm -hmm. It's a lot of vertical yes. stuff going on. 20 years, mm -hmm. 20 years in the game, mm -hmm. like independently, solely mm -hmm. doing music, 20 years. Mm -hmm. Full time. Full time. Mm -hmm. That's amazing. Mm -hmm. What the heck is next? Uh, just more of this and teaching workshops, maybe a book or something, eventually. <laughs> 